first of all, very Thank competitive you. fight. Kevin Pedraita, he came to fight pretty oh, even fight yeah. if you ask me. Give us your assessment about your performance. Yeah, tonight. just that um, it, it was a really good fight. We're just going back and forth, and I was just like, damn, I just need to squeeze out the last. I, I know I got the early ones, the middle ones are kind of questionable, and then I, I think I, I got I got them in the last round. So you agree with the judges scorecard? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. What sure. made this guy so difficult? Tonight? I think he was uh, he was coming down in weight. I think he is. He, 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 he seemed big. He was fucking huge. <laughs> For me, I felt like you know, but it was cool. It was a it was a good win, good learning experience because it took me to a, a place that I haven't been. Before. Given the fact that he hadn't fought here in the U.S., most of his fight he had fought him in Colombia and Mexico. Yeah, he was tough. You think he has faced better opposition than than you? I don't know. I haven't really seen. I don't really see too many fights, but I just seen a a, a little clip and that was it. Yeah. From the time you took that fight against him. Yeah. Uh, about two years ago, up until now, do you see yourself as a better fighter? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every day I'm trying to get better, you know, so I just take it day by day and uh, even 1% better is, is, is good enough for me. Second fight under the CBM promotional banner. Um, any plans of you keeping uh, fighting with under, under their promotional? Yeah, uh, yeah wh whatever uh, good opportunity seems good, I'll, I'll take it. All right. um, are you in position to pull out better better fighters out there in the 130 pound division? Uh, honestly, right now I'm just taking it day by day. I just need to go back and uh, I, I need to fix some things and then uh, go back to the drum board. What were some of the things that you need to work on? Um, just more experience. Uh, just everything. We, we always need to uh, continue to keep getting better, you know, as, as not just in boxing, but just as, as people, we just need to uh, uh, try to strive to get better, even if it's just a little bit day by day, you know. Is Eric Mondragon's state of mind fully focused uh, in boxing right now? Yeah, right now I, I am. It's just, yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> um, did you feel the pressure of performing on a uh, on, uh, Fox on a uh, part like tonight on Fox? Uh, the um, not really. I, I I just try to focus on my opponent, you know, because any little distraction is, is not good. You just need to focus on the man in front of you. That's it, you know. What is uh your coach, uh, Yuka Morales' assessment? What do you think? How do you rate yourself? Uh, um, your performance tonight. One out of ten, I probably give myself like a. a I'm my biggest critic, so maybe like a six point five. I feel like I could. I could I didn't feel my best tonight, but I, I got the win, so that's all that matters. Uh, any messages out there for the fight fans? See the Maywood representing the Maywood uh, Boxing Gym? Uh, if you want to come to Maywood Boxing Gym, we're right here, you know? And uh, that's the uh, best gym. All right, there you go. Pull up. Pull up. Pull up, Maywood Boxing Gym. Eric Mondragon, uh, thank you. successful thank tonight you, over Kevin Pedraita. And, uh, thank uh, you, Ozzy. Great to see you again, It's man. always great to see you. Go ahead and uh, keep putting on that good work. Yeah, thank all you. Right, thank yeah. you, guys. Yeah. See the man we're representing? Hell no, what, man?